Hey everybody! Uh, it's welcome to another episode of Eve's Guild. Uh, unfortunately, Eve and Sneaky Quiet will be joining me in this particular video, but we're doing another one for you. So I'm Cheesy Metal, and I guess uh, let's get started. Um, I know we haven't done a video for a while. It's been uh, crazy, hectic lives for us. Uh, so we kind of been busy, but we're trying to get uh, some more videos. Um, I do want to say uh, some, some things that we want to talk about. Uh, first is uh, the release of Overwatch was yesterday. I did pick up the Columbus Edition for PC. Um, it haven't if you haven't heard, play it. It's amazing. You'll love it. Um, it's just one of those games where I had so much fun. Um, it's a first-person shooter, kind of like also kind of like a MOBA, but that starts a whole other argument <laughs> that I've been seeing. So it's just whatever you want to call it. Um, but yeah, it, it's also it's by Blizzard. Uh, it's uh, it's a real fun game. The collector's edition uh, collector's edition runs about one hundred thirty dollars. Um, I don't know if they're still for sale. I haven't really looked, but I had pre-ordered mine uh, a while ago, as soon as, as, soon as you could. Um, but yeah, uh, if you haven't, it was actually, uh, if you haven't gotten it, haven't played it, I really recommend. It's really good. Uh, the storyline for everything is still being developed. You know, they're releasing, Blizzard's releasing small snippets of videos of, of the characters that you can pick, so you can uh, kind of get an idea. Um, but I would say overall, the story overall is kind of vague, um, but really it's a fast-paced action first-person shooter mobile kind of game, so it's not really story-driven, so it's okay if it's not a big story. But being Blizzard, I had a, my, I, buy, I always buy the Collector's Edition for every Blizzard game that comes out. Um, even with the, uh, like, uh, Hearthstone and Heroes of the Storm, even though they're free to play, I still spend tons of money because it's just, it's a blizzard and I, you know, I have a Warcraft shirt on. I mean, come on. Um, so yeah. But if you haven't looked into it, totally check it out. Um, I would love to play with y'all if y'all want to come team up one of these days. Uh, my favorite character so far is Hanzo. I just love that guy. I don't know, it's just, for me, this is, he's really awesome. So yeah. And I guess this, to start the second part of this video, um, we I have a loot crate that I want to unbox for you. Um, unfortunately, one of the main reasons why we did stop doing uh, loot crate videos for y'all was because uh, Sneaky Pie and Eve had to temporarily uh, suspend their loot crate subscriptions for whatever personal reasons they had. Um, fortunately, I had kept mine. Um, it was just been. I haven't had a lot of time to really, you know, pretty much I come home from work, I open it, go straight to bed. I work it a lot, so I haven't for the past few months. It's been really hard, but I'm going to do one because this one is a very special one because this is the one before the Warcraft movie comes out. Now, I'm not going to talk too much about the Warcraft movie because uh, we actually do have a video planned for that that we are going to discuss the Warcraft the movie in more detail and our opinions about it. Um, but there will, there is a Warcraft item in this box, so which is kind of like important for us too. So let's open it up and figure it out what's in here. Let's see. Okay, there's something. Okay, well, there's always a shirt. There, every box this year will get a shirt. That's something that uh, Luke Crate had uh, mentioned earlier in the year that every box will get a shirt. I believe they mentioned that in at PAX South, which I was there. And uh, let's see, what is this? Oh yeah, Warcraft T-shirt. So from the uh, orc and the human, orcs with the axe, humans with the uh, sword. That's really cool. Now normally I don't wear gray shirts, but I'm gonna wear this one because this is really cool. I like it. I like it a lot. It's really cool. Anything Warcraft, I absolutely love. Okay, so let's see what's the next item. Looks like it's a mitt from Marvel. Oh, the baby glove. That's so cool. <laughs> it's a cookie mitt, but it's the Infinity Glove. That's badass. I like that. Okay, got a squishy thing. Okay, 
Oh, shit. It's actually the number four Dragon Ball from Dragon Ball Z. The awesomeness of this is over 9,000. Okay, so I got a bot, a big box. Let's look at it. Let's see what is this is. Um, Q Fig. Oh, okay. It's a hook statue from the Age of Ultron. one of my favorite ones, but he's not one of my least favorite ones from the Avengers. So he's kind of in the middle for me. I like him. He does have some really cool stuff. So. Okay. So this thing. Okay. Uh, let's see. I don't know what that is. Okay. So it shows this monthly. It's a pin. Um, they're no longer doing the buttons this year. It's all pins. And the pins all come with some sort of digital loop, whether it's a comic book, a code for a game. Um, just random things, um, who knows, but it also says the theme of the month, which is power. Uh, that's, it's really cool. I, I like, I love the digital loop. This is one of my favorite things. And last but not least, the booklet, which it always comes in. And the box, which is decorated inside. Um, the boxes, uh, Loot Crate boxes run about $20 a month, um, shipping and everything, it's really, really cheap, really good, uh, price, and I mean, it's, you can set up a subscription for a month on month basis, where you pay monthly, um, you can pay three months in advance, six months in advance, or even up to a year in advance, and the more months you pay in advance, the cheaper it is overall, uh, when it comes to cost per month, and if you do actually pay, uh, if you have sign up for a year in advance, you actually get a free t-shirt, like, it's a bonus t-shirt. Uh, which I haven't done yet, but I kind of want to. So I'm not 100 sure if I will too, but I will or but I want to. Um, but yes, they also have other. Loot Crate also has other uh, boxes. Uh, they have a uh, Loot Anime uh, if you're really into anime. Um, they also have a uh, Loot Gaming, which is more toward not just standard nerd geek life, but more to you know obviously the gaming uh, subculture. Um, and that was a little more thing, almost like thirty dollars a month. Um, but I, just, you know, you, just, you do get to see what is included in their boxes are really amazing. It's you get a lot better stuff. I mean, this was twenty bucks. Everything I got was twenty bucks, which is hella worth it. That stuff they get there, it costs you thirty bucks. That's, but that's even better deal. And I think they also have a loot pet for just in case you have a geeky pet. Um, but yeah, so I mean, that's, uh, I guess that's the conclusion of this video for today. Uh, we do have another video that we are going to make uh, later on. We are going to discuss the Warcraft movie in more detail about our feelings and thoughts and worries and everything about the Warcraft movie because that is a really big movie for us. We've been waiting for very year, for many years. And that's the whole origin of uh, Eve's guild was we're in a guild and Eve was our guild leader and she... I mean, it was her guild, so, I mean, that's everything. I mean, Warcraft was a big influence on all of us, you know, on, on, on us being and hanging out together. Uh, besides being family and all that, but if it wasn't for family, it was Warcraft. Uh, but, yeah, so, uh, if you have any thoughts or comments, please uh, leave us a message. Also, find us on Facebook, too. Um, unfortunately, our YouTube channel has been kind of, uh, we've been kind of, like, unfortunately, uh, not being very interactive with it. We do apologize for that. But we are a little more interactive on our Facebook. Um, so, you know, if you find us on Facebook, I'll, I'll put up the link as well below so you can see it. Uh, but yeah, I'll give us a like, uh, let us know what you think, and, you know, just say hi. Um, until next time, I'm Cheesy Metal. Um, I'm sure Eve and, uh, and Steve probably would like to say hi and bye. Um, but like, we will be having another video shortly, coming out soon, in a few days, um, that we are going to discuss a little more about the workout. So until then, we'll see you next time.